Hi and welcome to the first video of our SimScale FAQ session. In this FAQ session we will cover the question what is a public or private project? So to answer this question I am on my dashboard right now and a good indicator to see if something is private or public is this symbol that you can see right here in the top left corner. For some of the projects or most of them on my dashboard you can see that they are private. If this symbol does not occur you can see that this for example here is public. But how can you change it? For example, let's see, we go to this project right here of the Bearing Bracket Analysis and you have several options on your project page. You can either open your project, which we're not going to do now. You can share it. This share option will be discussed in another FAQ session. You can copy it, delete it or edit it. That's what we are going to do now. So let's say I don't want to have it private. So the only thing I need to do is to toggle this option here. And now it would be public. So if I update the project and I go to my project page right now, you would see that's not private anymore. Of course, I can revert this setting right here, update the project again. Please note that this option right here of making projects private is not available for community users. That means you either need to have an academic plan or a professional plan. So if you don't have access to this toggle option, what you can do is to simply click upgrade my plan. This is also a nice option to see what features you have available in each plan. If you have any questions regarding that, feel free to contact me or one of my colleagues from the sales team via the chat function. And the chat function can be found on the bottom right corner, as you can see. So you can simply start a new conversation and reach out to my team and ask any questions regarding an upgrade option. So if you have any questions or doubts about this video, make sure to reach out to me either via email or post a question under this video and I'll make sure to reach out to you as soon as possible. With that being said, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next FAQ session. Bye bye.